Okay, now let's do a problem. Uh, the question is sort 70, 20, 30, 40, 10, 50, 60 using merge sort. So I have arranged it in an array 70, 20, 30, 40, 10, 50, 60 um, into an array. Okay, so the uh, let us begin the algorithm. We'll do the al uh, do the problem, and I will explain the algorithm in between. So we have an array A from uh, it ranges from low to high, and it's a global array to be sorted. So this is the array I've created. So, uh, this is your low, and this is your high value. So uh, it is a global array. This array you must sort. So uh, let's remember the first uh, the slide uh, the video I have shared before in the divide and conquer rule. First thing is if the problem is very small, that is problem P is small, uh, there will be only one element in it. So no need of sorting again because it is already sorted. If low is less than high, then there will be more than one element in your array. So look at here. Uh, low is uh, 0 and high is 6. So 0 is less than 6 means there will be more than one element in, in your array. So when there is more than one element in, in your array, next you have to do is you have to divide the problem into sub problem. So you have to find from where you have to split. The splitting place is taken by mid which is equal to low plus high divided by 2. Low. What is the low value here? 0. High value 6. So, so 0 plus 6 uh, by 2 is 6 by 2 which is 3. Now you have to start uh, you have to start splitting from the third position. So you can uh, start splitting that is 70, 20, 30, 40 into one sub list 10 50 60 into another sub list and this is the another sub list and you have split it from here so next you have to again split uh, this uh, sub list s1 and this sub list s2 so this is 0 1 2 3 this is 4 5 6 so now from where you have to split you have to find it out as 0 plus 3 by 2 which is equal to 3 by 2 which is equal to 1.5 so you have to split from 1 then so you have to split from 1 and you have to make it a uh, 70 20 together into a sub list and this is so you can make it a uh, 30 40 together similarly you can do this that is 4 plus 6 by 2 that is 10 by 2 you have to uh, yeah you have answer as 5 so you have to split from so next we have to split uh, 70 and 20 this can be easily splitted that is it becomes uh, so uh, 70 and this is uh, 20 next this will be 30 and this will be 40 and this one becomes 10 and this becomes 50 and this is again your 60 so you have to stop here because everything has become uh, single now so single uh, when it becomes single you have to stop there so, uh, so we have known where to split. Uh, the split from where you have to split is from low to low plus high by two. That you have performed everywhere. Sort for low comma mid. Then you have to perform the merge sort for mid plus one comma high. This is uh, low to mid, and this is mid plus one to high. Again, you have to uh, do the same procedure. So this is a recursion. And next, uh, next word the algorithm says you have to merge low, comma mid, comma high. So next we'll do 
uh, sorting and merging together. So merge should be uh, done along with sorting. So we are going to do merging and sorting together. So this two is should be merged together as 20, 70. Now what about this? We have to merge them together. So need of sorting this. This is already been sorted. Next you have to merge them together. That is 10, 50. Next the 60 is kept as such. Now you have to again sort this one, this one that is sort and merge. So this should be sorted and merged together. So it becomes 20, 30, 40, then 70. Again this should be merged together that is 10, 50, 60. So finally these two are merged together into a final sorted list. So, this so these two are merged together into the final array. It becomes 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 and 70. So, uh, this uh, merging is being performed by two-way merge sort. So we will discuss what is two-way merge sort, how it is performed now. So let us study how the merging is happening. For this uh, let us take uh, the one which is was there in an example of your previous example 20, 30, 40, 70, 10, 50 and 60. So let us see how to merge this. According to the algorithm says that uh, A you already know that it is an array ranging from low to high. It is a global array containing two sorted subset. Two sorted subset are there. Uh, one uh, part will be from low to mid and another part from will be mid plus one till high. Our main goal is to merge this uh, these two set together into an array A low to high and we also have an auxiliary array that is also in global array B is a global array which is an auxiliary array. So let us uh, start uh, how to do this. The first let us assume a pointer here. Let us the pointer let us take it as H and let me a pointer here let me take it as J and there is an array here I told you there will be an array here. This to do, uh, in which you have to arrange the sorted list. So according to the algorithm, I have assigned H pointer to the uh, to the lowest of one array, and uh, the J is an another pointer which is assigned to mid plus one, and one more. Uh, one more pointer I am going to initialize over here. So according to the algorithm you have to check whether H is less than or equal to mid and J is less than or equal to high. So check where H is less than the middle value yes and you have to check whether J is less than the higher value yes then what you have to do you have to check whether the element a of h this is the element a of h is less than element of a of j is that so no so we go for the else condition that is um, the else condition says that you have to assign the you have to assign uh, the value which is lowest that is uh, J is your lowest should be assigned inside the array the main array B next what you have to increment the value of J so J will be incremented till to here and the value of I will be incremented towards here ok now again you check whether the jth element or the 
H element. Which one is smaller? The smaller is 20 now. So, 20 is put inside the array and you have to increment the value of H and you have to increment the value of I. Okay. Now, again you have to check whether the 30 or 50 is smaller. Which one is smaller? 30 is smaller. So, you will again write 30. Okay. Now, increment the value of H pointer. Now, you compare 40 with 50. Which one is... Uh, so, we have one more thing I forgot. The I value is incremented. Next, we have to check 40 and 50. Which one is smaller? 40 is smaller. So, 40 is put inside the array and the value of H is incremented by 1. Remember the value of I of I. Now, we will compare 70 and 50. Which one is smaller? 50. So, increment the value of J as well as increment the value of i. So, next you will compare 70 and 60. Which one is smaller? 60. It does reach 70. Increment the value of i. Okay. This is what we have to do in our algorithm. Then one more thing has to be added in this. If h value is greater than mid, when h value, like the h value will be reaching here, again something is being been to be added from here like this one has stopped and this one like we had 80 90 uh, 100 something so what you'll do we will just copy this value behind this so that point is being discussed in this place of the algorithm if h is greater than mid then what you'll do we'll take we'll take an element uh, k which ranges from j to high arrange the value of a k to b of i if the opposite condition holds we will copy simply copy the value of um, that elements into b of i finally what you will do is add uh, the elements from low to high inside k that is the elements inside b of k to a of k so finally you will get a sorted element inside a of i hope you must have understood what is merge sort two-way merge sort thank you